Welcome back, another cup of the day. Today's map is by Trannon. Uh, cheap, cheap beach, so it looks like we have a theme. Looks pretty cool right off the bat. Um, no one else in VC today, just me. So let's see if we can get a win. We uh, There's no Maki or Yanja in today's lobby, so I need to capitalize on this opportunity. Um, everything seems pretty standard. Gonna wanna be going low in these, try and take the turns tight. Gonna look at those in photo mode. Ooh, why does it look like I want to go left there? Okay, I don't think this is gonna be the best first run ever, but it should be solid. He did say there was no risky, so I don't even have to look for it. 43.9, no idea what author time is. Looks like first place for the first run. Again, no Maki or Yanja, need to capitalize. I do like the landing left side here in order to conserve more speed on that turn. I gotta think about where boosters are, how fast they are. How low can I take all these turns? Yeah, it seems like a pretty straightforward map, honestly. Oh, okay. I want to kind of set up wide for that turn. That will be... Easy enough to remember. Get some runs in here. It does seem like a pretty straightforward map. I don't know what author time is. I'm thinking 42 is probably going to be what I'm looking to get at the end of this, based off of like the, the splits last run. I might even want to set up wide for this turn. No, I know. We're slow enough. I don't need to do that. I'm looking at this bomb tree as a reference point to aim um maybe you want to aim a little bit right of that because that jump is a bit blind so anytime you have blind jumps and you can use something in the background to help you out definitely worth doing set up a little wider here Still not great. Maybe set that up even wider. I'm curious what the split here is going to be. Never mind. Don't know what the split here is going to be. Zoman is still in the lobby. Obviously very good player. Going to have to worry about him. Round as well. Um, I believe, yeah, Round has won one. So a couple defenders in the lobby, even though there's no Maki or Yanja. Also right behind Zoman, so that is good. Get to see everything he's doing. Oh, Zoman going left there. Yeah, he's just better from that angle. Okay, I get it. So yeah, the reason Zoman went left there was just to be set up better for that turn. Yep, okay. Makes sense. I think I will test that out on this run. Ooh, slid out a little there. I did like the start, the lineup, but I'm gonna keep going. There's not really any point in resetting in the the warm-up. Zoman going very low there. That's interesting. Oh! There's a ramp on the left side of that tree. I just saw it. Zoman didn't do it either. That first turn, honestly, is a bit tricky because it's wood so you lose traction faster so maintaining traction is honestly tougher than it seems i'm using trees in the background on like all okay no no next one next one i thought it was left on that jump second jump Zoman in front of me again. I like that. I could have taken that a lot tighter. Could be solid. I do think I'm generally pretty solid at like grass and sand as well, so I like that. Watching Zoman, see if he's figured out that jump. Uh, that wasn't great. Oh, 
but is at 42 six. So second place right now, very slightly behind Zoman, and that was not a very strong run. So can definitely save more time. I don't know if 41 is gonna be doable. Let's try. Not the best start, doesn't really matter. I'm just gonna keep going. Yeah, this is better. Oh no, okay. I wonder if a little brake tap to reduce airtime there. 43-1. Okay, I feel all right about this map right now. Obviously, Zoman has the faster time. I'm going for first on this one. That is the goal. It is a difficult goal to set. Any airtime I could reduce there might be good. Uh, I think this should be another 42. Yep, 42.8, so another one. Um, should hopefully be able to do those 42s consistent. And it looks like there's only five people who have a 42 at all. So that feels pretty good right now. I might want to try and just take these turns tighter and not care as much about speed conservation. Because there's so many boosters around. Speed conservation really might not matter all that much. So that run I clipped the fence actually was really good because I got to those boosters faster. And at the time I didn't think it was good, but it definitely was. Let's see, we got another three hundreds to catch up to Zoman, and based off the splits we can definitely do that. Try and take some of these tighter. This already isn't the best run, but like, I don't care. Yeah. So I just took those kind of tighter, didn't care as much about speed because of the booster. Hmm. I'm wondering about even taking that wider. Because I really don't want airtime there. So yeah, another... Was that, I think that was another 42. I wasn't paying too much attention, but I feel pretty good about getting the 42s. They're not too tough. I'm using the palm trees to help line up these jumps. Uh, I want to know what this split is going to be, because I did take that tighter than normal. Yeah, okay. Makes sense. Uh, I don't know if that was better or not. It wasn't bad. Let's see. Um, 547. So I think we got a little bit of an improvement. Got time for one more run here. Remember, take these tight. Don't really care as much about speed because of the boosters. I think this was a little better. Nice, first place. I do this quickly. Cool. And we got the host control stuff out of the way. That was nice. First place. Happy with that. Should be getting a lot of those this cup, hopefully. 
focus up round by round. Good luck, have fun. I'm gonna turn players off. I know. Oh, oh yeah. Okay. I know kind of the line. I know what to do. Don't need to uh, worry about watching anyone else. Unless somebody beats my current time by like a significant amount. I think I know what to do. First uh, knockout round, always a bit of a stressful one, even though pretty much any time will be good. But it's still, you gotta actually put down the time, gotta get into the cup. So obviously we're gonna be good with that 42. I don't even remember what the times were in a warm up, like how many people had 42s. I don't think very many. That 42.6, I, I think probably less than five people beat that in warm ups, so we're definitely good. still want to win the rounds. Obviously advancing is more important than anything, but I need to make a statement this cup. No Maki, no Yanja. There's a bit of booster RNG there, one speed. I've noticed I can get 110 or 111 at times. That won't make much of a difference, probably less than a tenth of a second, but uh, it is no, it is notable. Something to note, people just continuing forward. Do I have names off? No, just names aren't showing up for some reason. Don't know who that is. Looks like three DNFs right now. One of them is Trannon, so that is to be expected. 07, so ended up with the 42.6 podium, not bad. That's a good time by Zoman, that 42.4. Being able to do that in rounds. Remember to turn players off. Um, okay. I wanted to make sure Tranon did not get kicked. Again, second round should all be fine. I just put down the 42, move on. I don't know what the like crux of this map would be. What the hard part, what where to focus. I guess it would be this right here. You can gain or lose a lot of time depending on how much air time you get there. And that was little air time. I think this should be a good run. Yeah, 42-3, nice. Um, dang, did not beat my PB. A uh, 100th off of my PB, which is currently the world record. Almost enough. Almost on PB. Oh, that's more than enough. I'm crushing the world record. This is world record pace. Not world record pace. It's tough to, like, kind of focus on the second run when I, like, know I'm good and I feel like I know the map. I don't know, like, there's nothing I want to test out. I just need to, like, get more practice in. Oh, that was good. This actually might be world record. Yep. Yep. World record by a good bit. Reset. Make sure GTR loads it. Whatever. It'll be fine. I really don't care about GTR. Let's see. Two DNFs at the moment. Kern, one of them. He was supposed to be one winning. Someone saying, nice time, TY. It's Kern. Kern is out. He was supposed to win, according to Ronin's stream. That is interesting. He is a good player. He definitely had a chance. He's been uh, top five, I think, a couple of times. But like I told Ronan's stream, this is this is mine. This one is all me. I didn't even see Zoman's time there. I think he got closer to me on his second run. That's a bit wide. This is not world record pace, but again, as long as it's a 42, should be fine. Oh, that actually isn't great. Still should be able to get a 42 out of it, but not 
my finest run. That was okay. Okay, 42-5. First place right now. Um, I'm going to guess Zoman will beat that. There it is. Oh, barely beat it, though. Try and improve. I do want to win as many of the rounds as I can. Again, this is supposed to be a statement. In Run and Stream, they were talking uh, no Maki, no Yanja, who's winning it, and they named about eight people without ever naming me. So I need to make sure people remember. It wasn't great. I might be able to take first. It's going to be close. Oh. Not only did I take first, that's world record. Cool. Okay, yeah. 41 is definitely doable. Turn players on there. Zoman did not get it. That looks like another first for me with no Zoman. I feel fairly confident saying that. He's the only other one getting close. Uh, three DNFs at the moment. I'm surprised by the DNFs. I wonder where they're crashing. I could see myself kind of clipping over here, or I could see a couple spots of clipping, but with two runs, it, I, I feel like this is not a very DNF heavy map. Shouldn't be, but kinda is. All right, let's try and get a 41. I think it is gonna be doable. Not that it's needed, but maybe uh, maybe once we get further in, Dominic will start pushing us, and then it'll be needed. I want to say you can get 112 there. That's probably booster RNG. Yeah, they were joking in uh, in Ronin stream when I said, like, all right, now I have to win this one. And they're like, this is about to be the quietest sandals video anyone has ever watched. And, uh, you know, buckle up. It might be true. Eh, uh, should be okay. It'll be a 42. Yeah, 42-4, not great. I wonder if... Oh, wow, Ronan. I wonder if Zoman is... Oh, I want to reset that. I'm going to turn players on in case I can see any of them. I see Ronan up there. I want to watch Zoman. I wonder if he's doing the jump left of that tree and catch that downhill. Um, kind of toward the end. I can point it out. But, because he wasn't doing that in warm-up, and I wonder if he started doing that. It definitely is going to be better. Do I have time? Uh, I think so. We'll be close. Not that I need it, but again, I want to win every round. Zoman currently without a time. All right, there's Zoman's time. Focus up. I want to win every round. Oh, that's not great. Nope, not going to win this one. That's fine. Not a great turn there either. That was a 42-6. I saw it flash very, very briefly before uh, going to the cut screen. I didn't even look who was out that round. Um, no idea. Let's see. Okay. Keep getting those 42s. I should look uh, this round how many people are 42. Uh, I really haven't been paying attention to much other than me and Zoman. That's all I've really cared about, to be honest. But it is good to know, like, roughly where the cutoff line is. If I, uh, for some reason, make some mistake, is it like, a, is a high 42 going to be good right now? Or. I think that was okay. Wasn't my best, wasn't my worst. Ugh. Yep, 42-2. Makes sense. First place at the moment. I'm gonna reset, I wanna watch people. Oh, that's a lot more people than I thought. I don't know why I thought there would be less than that. I really just wanna watch Zoman. 
maybe I just hop in photo mode and watch a zone and run. I feel pretty confident, but just giving up practice for free feels like a bad move. This is not a good run. All right, I can see Ronin. I don't see Zoman in the pack. Let's see how many people are going left. So it looked like Zeklord, Ronin, Saint Nick, and nobody else. Again, I don't know where Zoman is. I don't think he was in that pack. Let's try to find him. Is he on a run? Is this Zoman? It, uh, uh, nope. Oh, it's Zoman and Zodiac. So Zoman is going right of that tree still. I don't think that is a good idea in the long run. It's a harsher landing, more bouncing. I think it's going to be less consistent. So I'm kind of glad to see he's doing that because he's going to be my main competition, it seems, at the moment. But you never know with Cup of the Day. Sometimes people just start getting fast in the top 10, top 5 even, and start putting down some crazy times. So you never know. But at the moment, it feels like uh, Zoman is who I need to look out for. Dream players back off. Just... Should be able to get a little more frames in just in case uh, someone loads in quick or whatever. I don't feel like seeing it. I believe this is the last round of four elims. Four going to two. Oh, it's a bad turn. I'm gonna keep going because why not? Probably should have reset, but oh well. Everything is fine so far. This is not a 41, but it still should be a decent run. I think that was reasonable. I'm saying a point four. Oh, that wasn't great. Maybe point five. Ugh. Ah, point four. Round with the point three. Ronin with the point six. Okay. I don't see Zoman again. I wonder if it's because he's going right at that tree. Because that landing, he's definitely like bouncing on that landing. That's not going to be as consistent in the long run. Um, I guess he probably has players off. Doesn't know about it. I mean, there's no way he knows about it. If he had seen it, he would have done it. It's just very clearly going to be better. I'm not going to be the one putting in chat telling him about it either. I'll tell him after. After the cup, I'll let him know. I'm that nice of a guy. Could be a bit of a better run. Oh, I wanted to cut that close, and I ended up dusting right at the end. I don't think I'm taking first on this run. Nope, wasn't even an improvement. Wasn't uh, a great last turn. Oh, Lighter was out last round. I didn't notice that. And Lazy, and Diabler. I don't know the other name, so those three other ones I named. <laughs> Sorry to JP. <laughs> Let's see. Everyone with the time makes sense. 43s are out. Some 43s still making it through. So it looks like there are 12 uh, 42s. 42997. Sneak it in two face. Top 14. I want to say it's two Elim now. Yep. Two Elims. Still feeling very good about this. That was really good. I got to focus on this run. This could be a very, very fast run. Oh, slid out there. This is not a very, very fast run. Oh, well. I should look at my splits just to know, because I don't know how much I lost with that slide out. There was a small part of me that was like, do I reset? But I think it's still good enough. I think that was solid, and I'm kind of on the right side, which helps set up for this turn, even though that wasn't very good. Okay, a point five. that makes sense. It was, yeah. Slid out, let's see how much that lost me. That was not nearly as good. Yeah, almost a full 10. Almost a full 10th and less speed. This is not great either, but it still should be green now. Yeah, I slid out lost me a lot of time. Because that also wasn't very good, but still gained over a 10th of a second. Set up wide, take it in. I kind of like that, to be honest. Let's see. 
Okay, a point four. I think I set up too wide. I ended up losing some time with how wide I set up. Big buy coming in. Akane and Dyrex currently on the bubble. Don't see anyone. Looks like that is gonna, oop, Ronin. Yeah, Ronin going on the left side of the tree. We saw that earlier, no surprise there. So they get third place, not awful. Not, not what I want. End of the round, Akane and Dyrex. Couple of four, Zek Lord, 43. Oh, he was one of the ones who was supposed to win this cup. Sorry, this one's mine. Oh, Ronan sniped me at the end there. What well, even was my time? I thought it was a point four. Oh well, doesn't really matter. I'm resetting. I don't care. That wasn't good. Wasn't great either, but good enough. I'm just gonna keep going. <laughs> uh, probably wasn't worth resetting the first time, but oh well. Still have time for two runs, not a big deal. That was pretty wide. This is not great. Lost a little bit of time. I need to get back to that point one. I kind of, I feel like I've kind of gotten cozy of like, all right, put down my point four, move on. I have world record with the point one and uh, I need to kind of get back into that mentality. Oh, that wasn't good. I don't even know if this is a point four. That was not very good. Now point six. I'm gonna need to improve that. I should be fine without needing, like, without really needing it, but oh, that's not a good time. It's a little tighter. A little better. I definitely lost time at the end, so this start, just doing the start better is already good, but I can gain at the end. Ooh, I don't think that was great. I feel like I slid out a little. It's tough to tell because it's underwater, quote unquote. It's just the blocks. I don't think that was great. Got the 111 though. That was okay. Should be an improvement. I don't think it's great. Yeah. Oh, zooming with the point zero. All right. I got to get, I got to focus up, get down to that. Zooming now with world record at point four. That's yeah. Okay. Know how to do it. I'm surprised Zoman with his line got the point zero. I guess it wouldn't lose any time if like everything goes well, but interesting. Second place, who got out? Um, St. Nick and Two Face, I believe, with 42 eights. High 42s are getting out. So high 42s are starting to get out. I definitely need to. Oh no, Quick Racer and Revenge. They were already eliminated on that screen that I was looking at. They had already updated them, so St. Nick and Two-Face scraping it by with the high 42s. I need to focus up on every run now. When high 42s are getting out, I, I know I haven't been putting down high 42s, but I could see I lose focus on one run, get a high 42, and, uh, and that could be it. That's how fast cup of day happens. This could be a high 42. Don't think this was very good. Okay, 42-5. Where even am I? Oh, I'm in second. I entirely missed my name. I was looking at the leaderboard and like, what? Yeah, reset. It is really tough to keep traction there with the wood. Uh, you definitely don't want to set up wide. I see some players doing that. It's not worth it. But uh, it is tough with the wood. You lose traction faster. I'm resetting again. Not that I care about that extra hundredth, but I can be green here, and I kind of lined up this jump uh, not how I wanted. That was more of the reason why I reset, was the lineup of the jump. Yeah, this isn't great. 41 by zone, and wow, okay. I need to do that. I think next run, next round, I am just lasering in. I need that 41. I'm wondering if Zoman's brake tapping there. Because that is, you can gain or lose a quarter of a second fairly easily at that part. Not a good run there. Uh, oh, I had players on. I guess I could probably leave players on the rest of the way. I'll give Zoman the nice time, the 41. 
That is impressive. First 41. Uh, who was it? Oh, now it's St. Nick and Two-Face. <laughs> I talked about it last round. I talked it into existence. I'm sorry, guys. 41, how? I understand how. Uh, Zodiac is saying in chat, how? I get how, but that is a crazy time. Like, that's just doing everything clean in one run. Good start, good end, good middle, good everything. I think this has been solid so far. Oh no. Hmm. Interesting. I don't know if I have time for two runs, so. Pressure, now we focus. This is not good. This is my only run. And I am out. Wow. Oh my god, I'm so mad at that. Oh, I can't believe I clipped. Wow, that is awful. Dang. Wow, what an awful run. It's not my worst time all day. Other, like, other than the warm-ups, like the very first ones. I believe so. Yeah, just... Flipping the tree on that first run. Kinda killed it. Oh, that one is deflating. This one, obviously, Zoman, uh, I think in the past couple of rounds, has proved he, he was kind of getting it a little better, but I was right there with him. I feel like if I could have stayed alive till the end, I'd take my chances in a 1v1, see how it goes. But just the smallest tree clip. I think that run before was also very good, so that is. But watch Zoman. Um, see if he is still doing that uh, right side of the tree or not. So Zoman is setting up wide. I'm surprised. Oh, he's setting up wide here as well. Oh, I understand why he's doing that. So that there's boosters on that ramp and he wants to maintain the speed from those boosters on this part. So he's setting up wide to be able to turn less after the boosters. Oh, Wow, that is a crazy line. Oh my, this is so clean. What is this gonna be? This is so clean. This is a 41, yeah, 41.7. Wow, what an insane line. I wanna watch that again. I mean, Zodiac and Ronin, I want to watch. They're uh, both on the bubble right now, but I want to watch this 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 line again. That is crazy. I wonder what round he found that out at. Cause I've been kind of trying to pay attention, and I watched a few of his runs, and he was never doing that. This is very high. That's interesting. Um, I guess just to be able to set up to do this. He doesn't do it on this run. Why? Maybe he doesn't want others to know about it. He's trying to keep it a secret. Ronin with the DNF. I don't know where Zodiac is, but we saw Ronin crash there. Let's see, where is Zodiac? Are there two DNFs this round? Zodiac coming into the finish. Yep. Anytime is going to be good. Classic cup of the day fashion. Uh, the round after I get out it gets uh, significantly easier. Happens every time. So Ronin with the DNF. That is a crazy line by Zoman. I, I want to know what round he found that out at. Let's see. I'm watching Zoman again. I do think he loads in late as well because so that like we get to watch multiple lines, but wow. Let's see. We are on Zoman already. Perfect. A couple people loaded in front of him. We can watch. I'm about to panic on it. <laughs> All right, let's see. Does Zoman do it here? Yep, setting up for it. 
Wow. That is such a crazy line. And he's getting very little airtime there. I wonder if he's breaking. I feel like he probably is. Yep, another 41. So that's how he's doing it. Oh, I really want to try that now. I want to see what that is. How much of a time save is that? Wow. Does he do it on the second round? Looks like he's setting up for it. Okay. Yeah, getting more practice. I don't know why he didn't do it on the second round last time. Definitely want more practice with it. That is so crazy. Never even crossed my mind. All right, we don't need to watch Omen in photo mode. Who's this? Matt Zodiac. Matt currently without a time. Looks like he will be getting a time. I don't know how fast it is or anything. 42.9, not bad, but not good enough. On to the top four. Wow, another 41 by Zoman. I wonder how much time that saves. It definitely saves a good bit of time by missing the ramp. You're able to take it so much more inside and so, like, wow. I wish I knew about that. I wish I saw him. Like I said, I want to know what round he figured that out in, because I, I was trying to do a little better this time about watching others see what they were doing. And I watched him a few times, but I never saw that. Crazy how much one corner does. Yeah, yeah, the uphill determines quite a lot if you can get air time or like reduce your air time there. This is so insane. What a fine. Oh! He probably only has this one run. That's what I did. And I only had the one run. Pressure run for Zoman. Big buy with a time. There are three resets. Rounds right there. Okay, Zodiac has a time. Again, not the strongest times. Dang, I can't believe I got out. These, Looking at these times and thinking about what I was doing on every run, I'm like, come on. Okay, I'm guessing Zoman's going to be fine with anything hitting the finish. Yeah, that looked pretty good. Yeah, he'll be good here. It's not going to be a 41, but... Oh, got a little close to that fence. 42-1, yep. Yeah, Zoman is the heavy favorite here. So let's see, is pick by on a run? He is. Let's see, needs the point six. Didn't see the uphill, so I don't know. Ooh, the point two. Nice. It looks like Zodiac. Yeah, Zodiac says in chat, and he's already in photo mode. Yeah, Zodiac will be out. Let's see, does round know about Zoman strat? Does he try it? Ooh, looks like he's setting up for it. Okay. I think he just saw it for the first time. Like, that might have been his first attempt at it. So let's see, I wonder if he'll start going for it in Elims. Because obviously he's on the bubble with that point four when we're, we're getting down to it. And if he does make it to the 1v1 with Zoman, it's gonna be needed. Not that not that Zoman is clearing in. He he hit the tree last run, it can happen. I, I did it as well. But uh feels fairly safe to call Zoman in. Uh alright, we'll watch uh who's at the back round is top three here yep zillman setting up way wider than the others he's doing that to conserve some more speed on the sand section wide there as well i don't know if that's intentional or not okay zillman and round look like they're gonna be setting up for the round is not oh and round is going right side of the tree wow yeah you definitely want left side of the tree there you also oh no Okay, the air time. I mean, he's, he's going to be the slowest, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, makes sense. We'll stay on round. We can watch all three of them. Zoom in with another 41. That is crazy. 41.9. Crazy, crazy.
let's see if round go well round i don't think will go for it the point six is not very good huh i guess that would probably save some time what they're doing zoman crash doesn't matter he's already in that's it Round did not reset with enough time, unless he knows a line that can get a 38. <laughs> yeah, that will be it. We have uh, Doman and Pigby on to the top two. Good luck to both of them. Obviously, I think Zoman is the heavy favorite. I'm not going to make Pigby upset saying that. I think he would agree. I don't know who I'm rooting for. I guess I want the defenders give out less rolls. Oh, wait, Pigby has one, so... All three of those have won one before. Nice. Look at the defenders. All of us did great in this cup. All of us. Who's over here? Oh, they're just going AFK. Zoman and Pigby. Good luck to both of them. There's no way I don't even know they're risky. Huh. I guess he knows about... I'm assuming he's talking about the jump Zoman's been doing. So I guess he knows about it. I wish I had known about it. I, yeah, more people started doing it toward the end, so I had more chances to see people doing it. Zoman with a better start, and Zoman's end is also just very good most of the time, so let's see. Zoman going for it, pick by not going for it. Gets it. Yeah, I don't think I agree with Pig by not going for it if he knows about it. Because, I mean, you gotta assume Zoman's gonna get it. This is gonna be a crazy time. This might be a 41. Oh, 42 0, so not a 41. Um, yeah, I mean, you. I guess technically it's not needed to beat it. I believe I had a. Z did I have a point zero or did I have a point one without it? But, I mean, you, you, you kinda need it. And I think Pig by should have known that it's needed. Putting down a safe time is always good, but when you're in the finals and Zoman's been this consistent, just throw the safe time out the window. Let's see. Does go for it. Ooh, it's a lot lower. Nope. That's going to be it. GG's. Congrats, Zoman. Congratulations. Anyways, thanks to everyone for playing. If you want to play in these in the future, join the CTR Discord link in the description. We, generally speaking, have one per week, and I'll see you in the next one.